Well, it's been three days since we put everything up. We got some pretty serious wilting going on, which is what we want. And you'll see some of the leaves have already started to turn. What we're looking for, as you can see how this is getting kind of yellow, that is the chemical process that we want. If it dries green, it'll be kind of herbal, low quality, low grade tobacco. We don't want that. When they turn brown, the midrib right here, this has to dry down. If this doesn't dry down, we're going to run into mold problems, all kind of other stuff. If you do end up with mold, you cannot use bleach or anything else to remove the mold. Good ventilation is the key, which we have going right here. After our leaves are dried, the midribs are down, you can kind of see there how the stalk is still green. We need that to turn brown at least yellow, dark yellow, let the stem be completely dry. We've heard that some of the lower grade quality snuffs actually take the stems of the tobacco and grind it and then sell it to us. But we're not selling anything here. We're just growing it for our own use. We're going to look into that some more. Save the stems, maybe do a test run. Let a guy you don't like dip it, see if it's okay. I don't know. So that's where we're at. We're doing pretty good. We had a couple cool nights, but nothing too cold don't look like anything got hurt. Very happy with our tobacco right now, even considering adding three rows in the front yard instead of just two.